Hey everybody, thank you all for subscribing. This is our 400 subscriber Q&A. We are here to answer- Get out! You're in the frame. And so the characters are going to be answering all of your questions that you gave us. And then the creators- Get out of the frame! And yeah, so when we're done answering our questions, the creators are going to answer their questions. And let's get- Get out of the frame! You know, you know, I'm done. Let's just get into the questions. No, I've never taken my Gucci's off. We go everywhere together. INCLUDING THE SHOWER! Well, uh, I say BB because it's a cool thing to say. And it just makes everything better. And it's an awesome word, okay? So I will always say BB! That top hat dude in Bo Mobile asks, How's Miss Peer? I don't want to talk about it. Well, um, there are some horrible people, some unexplainable people, people that just ruin people's lives with their presence. And that's that guy who cut in front of me. A Burger King. Oh wait, Elmo? He's just weird. If I ever did shave my mustache, I can't imagine the disappointment to Mama and the whole country of Italy. What are you talking about? There's no cookie in my hand. What me most is that I'm starting to ask the same question. This question looks great, and I'd love to answer this question if I could read. Well, um, I really like GTA 5 and Red Dead Redemption 2, but. Me and Cookie both know the best game of all time is Wii Sports Resort Sword yep. Fighting. Yep. We're actually masters at it. Yeah, I beat him so many times. So I'm definitely better than you. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, uh, I, I used to love video games. Did that one fateful day, Mama took my Game Boy. <laughs> My mega form? I'm not aware of any mega form of me. I mean, one time a guy at McDonald's called me mega, but I think that just meant I was fat, because he also two seconds later called me a hippo. So, yeah. Well, uh, I have heard of this Gru guy, but I have never seen him because I do not have time to watch movies because I always work out, BB. But if I ever were to see this crew, I would assume he's Jack and looks good like me, BB. If you're talking about my hair, no. But everything else, I'm bald mustache down. Well, uh, to be honest, I don't really know who this Sonic guy is. Sonic is the enemy of the people. He is the greatest threat to Egypt. He is training an underground army of penguins. I will not Sonic. I hate Sonic. Well, um, mostly because I forgot how to close it. But, you know, I don't mind because it makes me a lot more effective at eating Happy Meals. Diddy Kong and me go way, way back, BB. 
He's actually my nephew. But I haven't seen him in years. I just, I guess I started working out too much. And we got separated, BB. Of course I don't hate Luigi. I love Luigi. Because when he's around, I feel, I feel better about myself because his life's more pathetic. I hate you, Mario. To be honest, I didn't even know what cookies were. Until I saw one in my hand. And I don't even know how long it's been there. Number one? Of course I am number one. I don't want to be number one. I already am number one. I was number one at everything I did. In fact, I'm employee of the month. For Luigi, there's only two employees. And now we are going to go to the creators of our video. Don't ask about Miss Piggy ever again. Hey guys, um, we're the creators of the video. And here we are with the questions you had for us. So, question number one. What is your favorite characters in Hyper Mario World? Uh, I guess I'll start. My favorite is Blastoise. I voice him. I think he's a pretty funny character, so yeah, I like him. I like Luigi simply because, like, I do him, and he's pretty easy to do. He's kind of relaxing. Uh, I guess I'm a cookie monster. All right, well, there you have it for that question. Next question. When did you start plush tubing? Well, we started in late June, so that's about two, two and a half months ago. Next question. Who inspired you? Mostly uh, older SML that we saw when we were kids, as well as Super Mario Richie. And last question from Cool Mario Films is, will there be another giveaway? Probably. Yes, there will be. We have one planned. It'll be coming very soon, so stay tuned for that. Alright, next question from Quick Mario Bros. Why did you start YouTube? Well, um, it's just another thing that is just really enjoyable to do. Yeah, that's... Yeah, we just kind of found it fun, I guess. Alright, next question. The top hat dude, when is a face reveal? Probably not anytime soon. Yeah, we don't really have one planned. I mean, possibly in the future, but definitely not anytime soon. Yeah. So sorry if you were really hoping for one, but it's definitely possible in the future. Just for right now, we don't really have anything planned for that. All right, next question from KP117 Pisa. What do you like to do in your free time? Well, um, all of us play hockey. We all play ice hockey. Some of us play pretty high level. Um... I like to skateboard. Same with me. Um, you work out, lift weights, things like that. Um, just kind of, we like doing sports, occasional video games. Yeah, it's watch movies, things like that. It's pretty much what we do. Basically, yeah. Alright, next question. Plays Productions. Can you promise to never change because you are what I call good content creators? I wouldn't say that we would change our videos, we'd probably like evolve them I guess. Yes, we, we can promise we'll keep making the best content we can and if we ever make any changes it'll only ever be to improve the video's quality and the enjoyment of the viewers. Yeah. All right, next question from Hig World 2. How many voice actors are there? Well, the simple answer is there's four of us. Our youngest brother, only he's voices Ninja. 
and he's he's done a couple of voices on little kids like really minor characters like the ones at the park in the jungle so that's kind of what he does then i personally i voice blastoise and donkey kong as well as pretty much all the secondary characters like i voice lotso i voice um phil i voice phil and tons of the other really minor characters i do a few um i do luigi kermit i also did eggman and i did the raccoon but that one definitely that one hurt my voice um i also do woody and i did the um, the the mom from the jungle i voiced cookie monster mario uh hank all right next question from savage mario bros where did you get the name hyper mario world from well we just like thought of a lot of stuff really yeah we we wanted to have an original name and we kind of kind of saw the the trend going around in the community no offense to anybody that has these sort of names we just we saw the there's a most of the names are either insert word mario bros or super mario your name which i mean they're they're great they're great names but you know we just kind of want a name that stood out a little bit more so we landed on hyper mario world and we're we're pretty happy with it so all right, next question from Plush Gamer 14. What is your favorite plushie you own and why? Um, if puppets count, I would definitely say Cookie Monster is our best character we own. He's a quite rare puppet. We got him when we were very little, probably four or three years old. So really long time ago long long time discontinued so we really value him and we like how he looks and stuff but if you want specifically a plushie we'd probably say blastoise yeah i like blastoise but i also kind of like the the dinosaur that i play yeah he's good too but most of the rest of our plushies are not really rare they're just kind of the normal nintendo plushes so yeah i'd probably say blastoise and how did we come up with your style of plush making well again something important to us was being original standing out in the crowd so you know we we just kind of looked at what characters we had and we wanted to be original so we created the characters of Blastoise and Cookie Monster and then came up with Kermit and then we just kind of went from there and just kind of made our own little original universe and we were quite proud of it so yeah. All right next question do you guys ever plan on vlogging? Well we don't really have a specific plan on it but in the future especially if our channel gets big it'll definitely be a possibility. We have some pretty funny behind the scenes that would probably be enjoyable for you guys to watch, so it's definitely a possibility. Alright, next. Questions from other Mario Bros. Why does Donkey Kong say BB? Well, we kind of thought it was funny. Um, it's, it's a unique thing to that character. And if you really want to know where it came from, it's... It's from uh, a guy I used to watch on YouTube. Um, he's a quite small. He's, he's like a fitness YouTuber, and he always said BB. And I thought it was quite funny. So, and it worked well to add to Donkey Kong's character. So, um, second, how old are you? Our crew ranges from eight to seventeen. Where'd you get the Donkey Kong plush from? We got it in a store called Discovery Hut at a mall nearby where we live. 
I'm not I'm not sure if I, I don't know if it's a franchise store or not so there probably won't be a one of those stores near where you live but yeah that's where we got them next question from plays production what do you guys use to edit um I use a combination um for the video making itself I use video leap and iMovie iMovie is really good for splicing clips and volume adjustments and all that a video leap really has like the good effects and all that that I use. And for thumbnails, I use Superimpose X, Adobe Photoshop, and just some font tools free for the internet. And yeah. All right, next question. Hour from hours on end. How are you so good at making plush videos? Well, first off, thank you. And. I don't know, we just kind of saw the plush tubers and Yeah, we 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 just um we put a lot of effort into our videos and we take a lot of inspiration from movies and things like that and we just kind of we look around and we see what looks good in videos and we kind of just learn and apply that to our videos. We All right guys, for this next question I know it wasn't supposed to be for the creators, it was intended to be for Mario and Luigi, and we fully saw this question coming, we expected you guys to ask, and that is, how did Mario and Luigi meet Blastoise? Well, we unfortunately we can't give you that answer today in this Q&A, and that's because simply we don't want to spoil it for you guys. We are for sure planning to make a full video dedicated to Blastoise's origin, possibly even an entire series. And um, if we gave you just a bland answer right now, it would completely spoil that for you guys, and we don't want to do that. So yeah, we're going to save that answer for a video, most likely a series even. So yeah, just stay tuned for that. It's going to be one of our better videos we ever made. And yeah, we're excited for it, and hopefully you guys are too. Alright, next question from Hours on End. Do you like Sonic? Um, it's an in-between we, we don't mind him, but we we never really got into his games or anything. I never really liked Sonic. I just, eh, I've just always preferred Mario. Yeah. yeah, we never really got too heavy into Sonic, really. I mean, Sonic's not that bad. But... Next question from him. Where'd you get Blastoise? Uh, I I got him at a Hot Topic store. Yeah, we got him from Christmas. Hot Topic, yeah. Next question from him. Do you have a Nintendo Switch? We did. We did have one, but we broke it. So, not anymore. Number five from him. What is your most wanted plushie? Well, if puppets count, our most desired puppet possible would be an authentic Kermit. Like Super Serious. Yeah, we. That would definitely be what we would yeah. want. I mean, but we all. There's also we're. We really want a few custom-made ones, like new. Yeah. Kermit. Yeah, we we're planning on getting a couple custom characters, but stay tuned for that. But yeah, most wanted character would definitely be a real show quality Kermit, but they cost like four or five hundred dollars, so it's I mean, a little... I guess on the size difference between the Kermit we have and that one would be big, like... Yeah, our, our Kermit, we got him off Amazon. He's, he's kind of low quality, to be honest. He's kind of ripping on the inside, so... Yeah, that'd be what we'd get, is a high quality Kermit. And next, what is your favorite Koopaling? My favorite's Iggy. Mine's Lemmy. I like Roy. Roy looks cool. Yeah, there you go. Alright, well I guess that's the end of our Q&A. Thank you guys for 400 subscribers again. And yeah, uh, we'll be coming out with new videos shortly, so stay tuned. Uh, we'll be back to our normal videos. And just a reminder, 
Uh, the last two videos aren't canon. The characters do not break the fourth wall. We just did this as like yeah, a little so. special. So don't don't. All of our videos are canon except for this one and the last one. So it's these ones didn't happen. The, just keep like, that in mind with coming episodes. The characters are not aware they're being filmed and on a show. Yeah. So don't treat these two episodes as part of the storyline. All right, well, that's all we have for you guys. Thanks for 400 subscribers, and see you in the next video.